Hello, I'm Pete Gerlach. I have been a professional family systems therapist for 31 years, and in that time I've spent 19 years uh, focusing on what it means to be traumatized as a young child and what happens to such people and how to help them. <clears throat> what I mean by trauma, uh, early childhood trauma, is parental abandonment, abuse, and neglect. Those have profound effects, psychological, spiritual, physical effects on young children. Over a thousand clients and students have revealed to me in my study um, a pattern that seems to be affecting a very high percentage of average families, perhaps yours, and this has caused me uh, to form a project, which I call the Break the Cycle Project. The cycle I refer to is the unconscious bequest, the inheritance of psychological wounds from childhood trauma and companion unawareness, which really means lack of knowledge. So this is a project for me, and that has led me to form a nonprofit website and these YouTube videos, which are all interrelated. The website is Seven Self-Improvement Lessons. They aim to correct the unawareness that seems to be epidemic in at least our culture. Um, the wounds that this project attempts to explain and offer a practical way of reducing are these. Personality fragmenting, which is normal, not pathological, means that many of us have personalities that are composed of sub-selves. Um, I won't go into detail here, other videos explain this, but these sub-selves can form something called a false self. The false self creates up to five additional psychological wounds. They are excessive shame and excessive guilt. I lump those together, though they're actually separate. Excessive fear, excessive reality distortion, excessive distrust, and difficulty forming healthy bonds. Those are the psychological wounds that my clients and students have repeatedly demonstrated to me, those who come from childhood trauma, as I do, they and I can be called grown, wounded children. Once people are aware of their unawareness, paradoxically, and aware of these wounds, there is a specific, effective way to reduce the wounds in exchange being controlled by a false self to a far better style of life controlled by your resident, wise, true self. That's a large part of what this Break the Cycle project is. The purpose of the website and this project has two goals. One is to alert you to the components of the cycle what is childhood trauma, what are the resulting wounds, and how can you reduce them? The second of two goals is, what are uh, the topics that our society does not teach us and that amplify the effects of these psychological wounds? The website aims through its self-improvement lessons to give you basic essential information in these topics. One, personalities, how they're formed, how they operate, and how to improve them. Two, how to improve your interpersonal communication skills. That includes how to improve your thinking effectiveness. Three, how to grieve well. Many of us grown wounded children have incomplete grief. That causes us psychological, spiritual, and physiological problems. 
So spotting and healing unfinished grief is a major um, skill that can be learned. That's lesson three. Lesson four has to do with improving all your relationships, adults and kids, everybody. Lesson five is some ideas based on the first four letters, uh, lessons, on how to create and maintain what I call a high nurturance family, meaning one that functions well all the time for all members. How can you do that? It's not easy. The sixth lesson builds on all five prior ones and is about effective parenting. The circle closes here because ineffective parenting causes psychological wounds. So lesson six offers concrete specific ideas and resources to help you parent more effectively. The seventh lesson is for those people who are interested in learning how to evolve and maintain an effective high nurturance step family. They are prevalent in our society as you know. So that's a quick outline of the seven self-improvement lessons that comprise this nonprofit Break the Cycle educational website. The website is located here at sfhelp.org. The lessons are non-denominational. The lessons are ad-free. I'm not selling anything except awareness, knowledge, and healing. As you, if you choose to study these lessons and as you start to experience the benefits of them in your own life and in your own family, I respectfully urge you, let other people know about this cycle. The inheritance that gets passed down unconsciously from wounded parents to their children who grow up, marry other wounded adults and produce children and give them wounds and unawareness and they grow up and repeat this cycle. Let other people know about this cycle. It's very widespread. I would estimate out of the thousand or so clients and students I've had across the 31 years I've been doing therapy, I would guess conservatively 80 to 85 percent of them show symptoms of significant psychological wounds and ignorance. So this is a very widespread problem that very few people are aware of. So you can do a lot of good by letting other people know about this website and these self-improvement lessons and the related videos. Here's a link to all the videos that relate to the Break the Cycle project. If you look at them all, they total um, 30 or 40 hours. So this really comprises, if you commit to studying and uh, participating in the Break the Cycle project, this is very much equivalent to a full college course. I frankly can't think of anything that's more important to study, especially if you have children now or you expect to have children or you care for someone else's children. The kids need our help to protect them from inheriting toxic psychological wounds and ignorance. Welcome to the Break the Cycle Project.